guys, this is Maverick Nuts Studios, and welcome back. Today, we are going to be playing some more Prison Architect. How have you all been? I hope good. Um, so yeah, last episode, we were in the process of... Uh, we were in the process of getting our library up, so that is being built right now. Also, um, I want to take a look at the rooms and see what else I need. So, parole... Uh, parole room that might be useful uh, a forestry I'm pretty sure the only way that works is if I have trees I don't know see I don't know if like the forestry is for prisoners to work with like prisoners working in the forestry or if that's just for workmen I'm not sure we could also get a morgue um, I'd like to get one of those up a morgue parole Maybe execution. <laughs> that would be a little bit fun. Um, reception. We could also make a reception room. You see, this would this front area is kind of where I want to have a reception room, but it's not big enough. Huh. Where can we put reception then? Huh. We could take out that wall, have that going out there. Yeah, I think we'll actually let's go ahead and demolish that wall. And let's put a jail door right there. And then let's go ahead and make stone all throughout here. And then we'll go ahead and black off those areas. Okay. And then brick walls or concrete walls rather. So this, this doesn't really need to be that big. Do like a 17 by 16. 17 by 17 maybe. Or maybe it should just be 18. 18 by 18 by 18. Maybe that's a, maybe even that's a little too big. Um, yeah, we'll do, we'll, we'll do that. Hopefully that's not too big. Um, and then we'll put a large jail door on that bad boy. And we'll have concrete walls running like that and like that. So that'll all be closed off. It'll just be an area going into there. That should be fine. Ooh! We just found garden gardening shears, I think those. Yeah, gardening shears on Paul Underwood. He's in for aggravated burglary. Burglary. He's got 17 years. Okay, okay. Good to know. Good to know. Most of our prisoners are saying they're well treated, which is good. How's our overall needs thingy looking? They want sleep, but we're, we're nearing the end of the day. Ooh, looks like we gotta search a few guys here. I'm gonna need to check your butt house, sir. I don't think that guy's gonna have anything. No, he did. He had a cigar. Found weapons? I can't, oh, it's a club. I thought I thought that was a cigar. Kind of look like, uh, kind of looked like a uh, cigar. Okay, free time. See, in their free time, they can also shower. Okay. I didn't know that. I didn't know they could shower in their free time. I didn't know that prisoners were could do that. Okay. Well, yeah, that's good. These guys are never on lockdown. I just noticed that. These guys are pretty much never on lock um, lockdown. Which is good for them. Maybe I should put a lockdown time right in the middle of the day, though. Like, lock up right then and there. Right in the middle of the day. Yeah, I think that'll work. I don't know. Maybe I should just keep that as yard. Yeah, I think I'll just keep that as yard, because I'm not having too many problems with, like, prisoners trying to break out or anything, so I think we'll be fine there. And also, where is my, where is my prison? My prison, okay, okay, I have it all on high. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Oh, and also, we need to go ahead and take a look at prisoner intake. And we can also, um, we can change this, as someone told me, I think I already said that before. But we're going to get mid or men 
security. And we're going to lower this down. So we'll be able to 69. We'll be able to take in like 21 guys, I think. I think that's 21. Hmm. I think that's, yeah, I think 21 we could take in. Because 2, that would be 7. 7 plus 1. No, that would be 80. So 31 we could take in. I hope, I hope I'm right here. <laughs> I really hope I'm right here. Or actually, we might be able to take in 32. Yeah, we'll just take in 31. I don't care if we have a few extra cells. I just don't want to have extra prisoners. So we'll, we'll get in a bunch of, a bunch of new prisoners. And also, I'll hire a few more guards to go ahead and balance that out. We'll get 40 guards here. So yeah, there they go. Um, we can also put a few more tables in. And if we could get a few more cooks, that would also be good. We'll probably have to make another cafeteria. Yeah, we'll probably have to make another cafeteria soon. And I'll hire another cook. Alrighty, hopefully they can they can handle that. Um, we need to run our power to over here. We'll go ahead and do that. Okay, there we go. There's security, so we need an office desk. I'll go ahead and get the items for that office desks. Okie dokie. And a filing cabinet. Okay. So there's that. I also want to put in CCTV monitors. And a door control system. If I actually ever want to set that up. I'm probably <laughs> not going to set that up, to be quite honest. Um, and then, if we can, I'd like to have a CCTV camera right there and in here. If we can do that. I don't know, last time I tried to use CCTV cameras, I, um, it didn't work out too well. You guys remember that. I'm sure you all remember that. Yeah, it didn't work out that well. Um, let's get, let's get one inside of the prison thingy. And it looks like we completed a grant, which is good. Um, let's go ahead and accept another one. Let's see, crack down on drugs, find 10 illegal narcotics for $15,000, hell yeah. We will take that. Ooh, whoa, okay, we already finished that, nice. Um, ooh, see, I want to do this one, but um, I think people are going to be really pissed off when we do that, so I'm not sure if I'm going to want to do that. 30 license plates, tool cleanup. Huh. Maybe I'll do a short-term investment. Yeah, well, we'll do that. We'll do a short-term investment. And we found shears in the cook cooking area. Maybe the cook's trying to uh, smuggle in some freaking gardening shears for a prisoner. I hope not. Um, let's get some more fridges. It looks like we need a few more fridges. So yeah, I'll get one more fridge. And also a bin in here. Let's get a bin in here. We'll hook that up. It's power. Okie dokie. Well, our prison's going great so far. Definitely going dandy. 11 workers. I could also hire another workman if I want to. Since I'm building a lot right now, but... I think I'll just leave it at 11. Well, anyways, nothing usually happens in the night, so I'll be back when it turns daytime. See you guys then. Okay, so it's getting light out here. In a few hours, our prisoners are going to be waking up and doing their, you know, normal duties. Yup, they're going to the shower now. Um, so I have the CCTV cameras set up. I'm actually installing electrical cables under those, so that way we can go ahead and get those ones working. Also, ooh, it looks like I forgot to connect this one. 
There we go. I might have to connect that one to power two. No, I don't. Okay. And we also, we, we finished the workshop. Ooh, we found a lighter on someone. We finished the workshop up there. We're still working on this area down here, but th that'll be soon. Or, that'll be done soon enough. So, yeah. And I also, um, the lights in here were a little bit messed up. I fixed up that. So, yeah. Um, hmm. I'm not sure if I'm going to want to, uh, do another working area down in here. Or what I'm going to want to do down here. Maybe I'll put the morgue down there. <laughs> yeah, I have the morgue right, right next to the workshop. That'd be perfect, right? Uh, garbage. Maybe we can put a garbage thingy over here. Maybe that'll, that'll be fine. Garbage. Do we have a garbage thing out here? Yeah, we do. Okay, maybe we shouldn't do that. It's, yeah, maybe let, let's not do that. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. <laughs> uh. I wonder what else I'm going to put down here. We could have a staff room. We could, yeah, we could have a staff room down here. That wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, we'll build we'll build a building like that. No, nope. like that, and then we'll load up this area right here. Okay, it's gonna be a staff room, so I'll put one right there, one right there. And we also need a door for up here. I'm not sure. I see. I don't know what I'm going to put up there. Let's figure out right now. Hmm. Maybe I'll just make another office or security office. Yeah, I might just, I might just do that, actually. Just make another security office. Alrighty. I think I'm actually going to block this area off as well. I'll go ahead and fill this area up with stone. And I'll put concrete walls. And... I'm not sure if I should put a concrete wall there or just a fence. We'll put a concrete wall. Actually, we'll put a fence. Or maybe we'll just put fences there as well. Okay. So that'll be like a little back alley area for our officers as well as our uh, staff. I think that'll work out fine. Should. Door servo, pressure pad. All right, well, yeah. Let's see here. Where is our generator? There it is. Okay. I have that thing on full power. See, I might need to um, also make another storage area pretty soon here. Um, yeah, let's leave this open. Let's leave that locked open. And this locked open as well. And let's also put some stone down there. Okay. And then surround. Uh, this will be reception. There we go. So we need office desk, a table, and a chair. Okay. Office desk. I think we'll have the desk in the corner. All right, and then we need tables and chairs. Okay. Then I'll just line up chairs, I guess. Okay, so I think I think something like that will work just fine. Even though it looks a little raggedy, but it'll work fine. And we got prisoners, and it looks like we have nine or eight more than we actually have cells for. So those guys are going to be staying. Ooh, hammer. Those guys are going to be staying in um temporary places. Oh, shit, I never hooked up. Ooh, that's a problem. I never hooked up... Uh, sensors there well let's do that now because that is a big problem where is it um shit 
Metal, yes. Okay. Yeah, that's a big problem. We definitely need metal detectors. I could have sworn I placed some there, though. I guess not. Um, and let's also place a metal detector... Or do we... Do, okay, we have some there. That That's fine. I was gonna place one in, in front of the workshop, but if I have some right there, that's fine. I don't really need it. Okay. Alrighty, we also, we need to raise our prisoner capacity to 100, so I can work on another area, or another cell block. Do I have to go into planning? How the fuck do I clone shit again? Copy and paste your existing structures. Well, I want to copy and paste that shit. Can I not do that? Why can I not do? Why is it not letting me? Oh, I have to right click. That's right. Okay, so we'll copy that. Or actually, let's start. Let's start from the right here. From the bottom right, actually. Okay. Place that like that. Why is that blocked? Why are you blocked? Do I have to build my foundation first? Oh, yes. I think I have to build my foundation first. What are you doing, Matt? What are you doing? How big is this bad boy? 24 by 25? Sure thing. Oops. That's a little bit too big. That's what she said. Ooh. Oh, god damn. Why did I do that? Ugh. Stupid right click. Okay, there we go. And then I think... Um, once we expand to the left here... How much is this shit? How much is that? 80,000? Can I purchase that right now? Oh, well, that wouldn't be a smart idea. Ooh, we're making $6,000. Nice. Our art guard staff might actually be a little bit outmanned here, so I'm going to hire five more. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Because they're a little bit outmanned. I don't want them to be totally outmanned. It's two to one in the prison here. I mean, it really should be. This is really... I have I have way too many guards. I really don't need that many. But better safe than sorry, I guess. Ooh, we found narcotics on him. Nice. Jeez. Some of these guys are really pissed off. What do we need? Recreation? Okay, well, you got free time coming up. Or you're in free time right now. And then you'll go to yard and eat. Yep. Okay. Well, we're doing good. We're doing good. And let's get our power back here. Okay. Yeah, that looks fine with the fences there. Let's leave that locked open just until these guys get finished. Heck, I'll leave all these locked open. Yeah, we'll just leave those locked open because I don't have any prisoners working in the workshop, so we're fine. But that'll, that'll be... Whoa, what the fuck is this guy doing? Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> That's one of the problems with also having a, a, a big, wide-open prison. Prisoners just kind of like... <laughs> there's another guy. <laughs> oh, man. That's perfect. That is perfect. Chappelle's lawyer? Fuck that guy. Get him out of here. We don't need no lawyers in here trying to shut us down. Ooh. Ooh. Fight. Fight. Ooh. Ooh. Where are the freaking security guards? Get over there. Is that it? Oh, death? Someone died? Oh, god damn. He's, he, he's like stuck under the dirty trays. Like everyone just piled their dirty trays on top of, on top of that guy. Just to like try and cover him up. <laughs> That's horrible. 
That is absolutely horrible. Jeez, um. These guys are wicked. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and leave that on normal. Leave this on normal. And I think I'm going to go ahead and assign a guard to there. Just to open up those doors for whoever needs it. That guy's going to be going into solitary for four hours. Nice. Good job, you. Misconduct murder? Oh, that's the guy who killed him? Paul Gordon killed him. Does he get, like, an extra sentence for that? He should get an extra sentence for that shit. <laughs> Jesus, man. Right into the freaking cafeteria. Just beat the shit out of that guy. And oh my god. What is this? What the fuck is this? What is that? Oh my lordy lordy loo. Lordy 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 loo. Let's go ahead and build our walls up. Hopefully that'll go away. That looks fucking disgusting. <laughs> Not liking that. Leave that locked open. And I'll assign the rooms right now. So this is going to be another security room. And this... Where is it? That is it. Or we can make this parole, actually. Huh. Maybe we'll, yeah, maybe we'll do parole. Maybe we'll do parole down here, actually. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't, I think that'll be fine. We'll have parole down there along with, you know, the security team over here. And holy shit, why are there so many people going on here? Oh, it's because it's a security area. They're just chillaxing. Okay, that's fine. And we'll get another one of those bad boys over here. We, we should also get a phone tap. That would be pretty useful. Definitely be pretty useful. Ooh, what's that? Metal sheet stacks. Okay, we're gonna need those. All, all the sign prisoners to there when when all this is done like when all this is completed Ooh, okay they found shears not surprised there um so yeah we need visitor tables visitor table and i'll just start putting them along the wall here oh boy this room is huge i don't know if i'm gonna fill up this whole room but Yeah, maybe I'll just do two rows for now, because <laughs> that's going to be pretty expensive if I want to fill up the whole room. So I think we'll just do that. And we can actually exchange these doors. Let's go ahead and dismantle these. And we can exchange them for regular doors. Yeah, we'll, we'll exchange, those, uh, exchange those for regular doors. It looks like they're going ahead and building this up here. So I don't know if we need to like hire a librarian or if we have to assign someone. Yes, okay, we can. Oh, required foundation education program. Well, let's assign as many prisoners as we can. Like that's good right there. And laundry, let's get as many prisoners as we can. We want our prisoners working their butts off. 11 interested. Okay. So, the foundation program. They're doing good in the foundation program over there. Um, we might also want um, separate classrooms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Separate classrooms. Ooh, something's going on. Oh, jeez. Um. Ah, another dead. Gareth Howell, age 20, ex-law enforcement. He's a snitch. And he's also... Yeah, yeah, he's a snitch and ex-law enforcement. Man, they have been going after the snitches in this place lately. And we also need to turn off our prisoner intake. 
That would be very bad if we if we took in prisoners. I mean, it, it, I don't think a riot or anything is going to happen. I mean, our prisoners are relatively happy. Ooh, hey, the solitary door is closed. Yeah, but our prisoners are relatively happy. So we should be fine. We should be fine there. They want recreation. I think they're sleeping right now, right? Yeah, they're sleeping. And this requires an entrance. We'll go ahead and build our large jail door in the bottom right. Yeah, I think once we once we build this last um, cell cell block here, um, I think. Oh boy, what was I gonna say? I just forgot what I was gonna say. Um, once I build this this cell block, I think I'm gonna go ahead and save up my money. Maybe I'll actually make a Morgan execution, and then maybe I'll save the rest after that. We'll see what goes on. Anyways, I also um, I started researching reduced execution liability. So once we have that done, we'll have all of the technology unlocked, which is going to be amazing. So yeah, that'll be that'll be pretty cool to have all the technology unlocked. So yeah, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this one here. If you guys are enjoying this Let's Play, make sure you leave a like. Be sure to comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!